Let's make some tamales using the leftover broth from our Beauty of Tacos. So I have some cooked chicken. I'm gonna add the broth to it and simmer it until it's softer to, to shred. Time to wash some corn husks and let them soak for about an hour. That's looking good. We're gonna make our dough with the lard, masteca, baking powder, salt, a little chicken bouillon powder, and then about a cup of broth, give or take. We're trying to get like a smooth peanut butter-like texture here. To see if it's ready, we're gonna see if the dough floats. If it floats, you're good, which we are. If it sinks, add a little bit more lard to it. Now we're gonna take our soaked corn husks. I like to dry off the inside just a little bit. I find that it helps make the dough stick to it a little bit better. We're gonna take a scoop of dough. We're gonna put it in a relatively thin layer, usually in kind of a rectangular shape. That's what I like to do because it makes the tamal come out into a little bit better of a shape. Once we get the dough spread out here, then we're gonna take some of the meat. I'm gonna strain it out a little bit um, and then we'll add that in. And then our goal is gonna be to fold everything together to seal that meat inside of it. And then we'll fold the corn husk so that it's easy to stand upright and steam because we're gonna put this in a big pot with some water at the bottom. And then I put a strainer in the pot and stand these guys up in it and steam them for about an hour and a half to two hours. First, you bring the water to a boil, then you drop it to medium. To check them, you open up the tamal. If the dough sticks, they're not ready and they need to cook longer.